my babies it is a lovely day like literally it's a lovely day it's warm outside it's feeling good I've just been doing stuff all day since I woke up like I made me some breakfast this morning I cleaned up around the house even though yesterday was Sunday so ain't much cleaning was there to be done but I still ended up doing a little something something you know just get some things done and then I just filled out some form for Ramirez to take back to school tomorrow because tomorrow is back to school so I've just been working yeah I need to start editing this new video for next week but your girl been on a roll I've been rolling I've been rolling all right but yeah your girl has been having a good day like my day has been awesome um it's been a good week it's been a good year it's been a good month you know like I'm just here as Ramir would say minding my business I'm minding my business it was nice checking in with y'all because I haven't when was the last time I came on the camera mmm I don't remember I honestly don't remember but yeah I'm back your girl is back in full effect okay I am back so um I posted the Sunday reset video and it's been doing good like the video is doing well I'm so um I'm shocked like I'm sh I'm shocked it's actually doing like good like that's the thing with me though like I'm really hard on myself I underestimate myself a lot but deep down I know that like you know like I'm that girl like I can do anything that I put my mind to so I need to stop doing that like I'm a, I'm really my biggest critic and I need to stop doing that because I got this okay girl Whitney JD you got this baby all right all right so yeah, I'm about to just go finish doing some stuff um I wanted to go on the road today I'm not sure if I'm gonna do that because I'm really tired but it's still early anyways it's 3 37 p.m. it's still early so if I do decide to go on the road I'm gonna take you guys with me making me some oats I'm gonna put my oats to soak so I can eat it later if you're a Jamaican then you know about our oh, soak oats and eat it all right but except in a Jamaica we use a look of tin milk and such but today I'm using my um, evaporated milk and I'm going to use sugar to me it tastes just the same after it soak up because you know say when oats soak it kind of it kind of it kind of come like milk in itself and plus a milk may make it soak in us so it's a good taste good with the sugar all right so i'm gonna get a piece of fire paper and i'm gonna just um cover it and make it soak sometime i add the sugar um before i make it soak but right now i can't bother so i'm just gonna let it sit there and soak but that's for later though because Right now, I'm gonna eat my Sunday Monday. When I already know how Sunday Monday bad, you know. As a Jamaican, Sunday Monday, ooh, chef's kiss. And if you're American and you don't know what Sunday Monday is, it's like our Sunday dinner that we eat the leftovers on a Monday. And it be fire. Alright? It be fire. <laughs> but yeah, so I'm gonna eat my Sunday Monday right now but my oats my soaked oats is for later when i feel a little bit hungry again when i feel a little bit peckish that's when i get my oats all right all right yeah but anyways i'm gonna go share my food and i'm gonna eat evidently i didn't end up going on the road today so i guess we'll be back at it tomorrow to see what tomorrow brings my baby goes back to school tomorrow and I am excited. Ramir says school comes back too fast, but it takes so long for him to get out. <laughs> Y'all please tell him that he ain't even halfway there yet. Like, boy. 
my baby's going to first grade today oh my gosh are you excited you are <laughs> are you really excited you're not excited my baby going to first grade okay i have a big boy what but when i put my ready confetti under my pillow i found money on coins on my tv desk oh you did okay i like your hair i know your hair is nice just got back from off the road huh you want water okay my baby want water all right as I was saying we just got back from off the road we went to Walmart and we did go to a few other places but before we get into that so let me get my groceries together like the few little stuff I got because I'm gonna make dinner um, today I'm making um spaghetti and spaghetti and meat sauce so Hence why I got my meat sauce and my spaghetti. Um, and also my ground beef. Woo, shit. I got this ground beef because when I get the bigger ground beef, it's, it be too much. So this one is good enough for it to be like done today or even have a little bit left over to do tomorrow, to eat tomorrow. So got that i got me some sugar got me some tomatoes because we ran out of tomatoes um some slap your mama uh -huh. um i got one of these things oh and we stopped at another store and got some turmeric yeah so most of these stuff are for my um spaghetti meal today and excluding this because this is for something let me push these to the side and tell y'all what this is for real quick. so i don't know if you guys see these steamed dumplings going viral on tiktok and stuff and your girl wanted to try it so bad like i've been on a hunt for these today like even before i went to actually physically try to go get them i was online searching for them i know they had them in walmart but i saw them like they were in stock at my location and then when i was actually ready to go try it they were all out and I went there just in case you know like it was a mistake on the website like they did, just didn't um, update it. I went in the store and child, the shelf was cleared. So I went on a hunt. Me and Reggio went on a hunt for these today and we found them. And they had a whole bunch but I grabbed four because child, I was going to wait until Ramir get home from school and wait until my husband got home from work but who got time for that? So I'm going to make me my own. But they can make their own when they get home. Like, they could try it, you know? But me and Regil is about to try one right now. It comes with six in a pack. These are the steamed dumplings. And we're, we're about to do it right now. Because I really want to try it. Like, I'm so excited to try it. So, we're about to do this thing now. You know? I'm so excited to try it. Like, I hope I like it. I'm excited. Not the steam dumpling hunt. What? Alright, so we're going to be making these together because 
I want y'all to see what the hell is going on with these damn dumplings. So I'm gonna put these other three in the refrigerator and then we're gonna make this one. All right? Oh, and by the way, they had um, different, I think they have, I don't remember, but I think the other one is vegetable only and then they have, this one is the, no, I lied. The other one is pork and vegetable and this one is chicken and vegetable. That's the one, um, all the ones I got are chicken and vegetable. So it says to cut a corner of the pouch so you can allow the steam to escape while it's being heated and what else? And heat it for a minute and 45 seconds. All right, and then let it sit for a minute. All right, where's my knife? Let me go get my knife, not knife, scissors. Whole time I'm thinking scissors but my mouth is saying knife. That be happening to y'all? <laughs> What? All right, so I did what they said, cut a corner. Oh, it smells good. Mm. Don't smell bad. All right, what did they say? Okay, put it in the microwave for a minute and 45 seconds. So it says to let it sit for a minute, but I'm just gonna go ahead and open it right away. Cause honey, we can't wait, honey. Oh, it's hot, child. Oh, Jesus. All right, so this is it. Um, first, let me pour this sauce that it came with, cause that's what I saw. I saw them pour this sauce all over it. Excuse me. And this is the sauce that came with the packet. Let me cut it this way so it doesn't. Then I'm going to pour it all over it. So these are all the these are all the ingredients that I have to go on there. First I have some sweet chili sauce, soy sauce, and this um spicy chili crisp. It's like a um it's like a chili oil. Yeah. All right, so let me get a spoon. But first we're gonna pour a little bit of soy sauce all over it. We, we don't wanna do too much over here because I'm, I'm very picky with my food. Not really say picky, but I'm very particular with my food. All right. Then we're gonna put the sweet chili sauce. Let me put the spoon on this. All right. Child. All right, there we go. All right, we got some sweet chili. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Let's put the um the spicy chili crisp. All right. I love spicy food, but I don't know how spicy this is, so I'm not about to overdo it. All right. All right. I don't want too much, too much spice on my ish, because I don't know how hot this is about to be, child. All right, child. We're about to, we're about to see what it's hitting for. It actually tastes good. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. It tastes good. I think I can do a little bit more spice. Hold on. But it actually tastes good. It actually tastes good. You want to try it? 
Raju don't want it anymore, guys. You do? Yeah. Then come get it. I got two left, so I'm gonna sit down and finish eating them. And I need me some water. But overall, it's not bad. The things you put on there really is gonna define if you like it or not. Get what I mean? But it's not bad. All right, y'all, so right now, what I'm doing is making me some banana fritters. So I just made my banana mixture so I can make my banana fritters because I don't know about y'all, but I know in my house, we don't let bananas go to waste, okay? So if my bananas are overripe, guess what I'm gonna do? Make me some banana fritters, period, all right? So I already made my mixture, and now I'm about to get my pot and stuff started. To fry my fritters, all right. By the way, my kids they love banana fritters, like, I'm not even joking, like, I'm not even kidding, they love them some banana fritters. And if you want, like, the ingredients for my banana fritters, um, you could go under my YouTube shorts, and I do have a video there that shows like the ingredients that I use to make my banana fritters. So, if you want a recipe, go check it out, go check out my YouTube shorts. Back to um the steamed dumplings if you were thinking about trying them try them and see for yourself how you like it and like i said before the taste do depend on the things that you put on it the stuff that i put on there it it was all right it wasn't bad at all like if it if it wasn't tasting right i would have said like the fuck but it was actually good it wasn't bad so i'm done making my banana fritters and chop I done caught the itis, so I'm going to lay down real quick and maybe take me a 30 minute nap and then I'll um, cook my food. But I, I, I don't know. I think I caught the itis from them steamed dumplings. Ciao. So I'm gonna put my nice banana fritters. You want banana fritters? Yeah. Okay, see? Reggie already want banana fritters. This shit gonna be gone in less than like before tomorrow this this all gonna be gone so y'all ramir came home and i told ramir that i tried the um the steamed dumplings and this boy gonna say i'm always trying stuff without him which is a lie because i'm always saving stuff to wait for him i ate mine because i bought a lot so he still can try it just not with me and what else did, what else did you say ramir like Always when I go to school you started, but I thought you just brought one, but you brought three, but you ate yours. Okay, yeah, I bought four, and I ate mine, so now it's um three in there. Oh, you didn't see the other one? But yeah, Ramir seemed like he wanted to go to war with me for them steamed dumplings, child. Not Ramir fighting over steamed dumplings. Not you fighting over steamed dumplings, Ramir. I'm about to go start cooking y'all because I did go take me a quick nap. It wasn't even a nap because I laid in the bed and I just I just laid there. I didn't even close my eyes or anything, so I don't know. Um, and then Ramir got home and now I'm about to start cooking, okay? Yeah, so, let's get busy with it. Yeah, let's get busy with it, right? Ramir said let's get busy with it, so let's get busy with it. Huh. All right, so I just did my garlic bread real quick and now I'm about to put it in the oven so it can do its thing. <laughs> 